Nowadays, we are developing the latest technology which can do almost everything by itself. Robots, smartphones and self-driving cars are just a small part of the great progress that has been made in recent years. We believe that we are far ahead of previous cultures and civilizations because of the complex and amazing innovations and inventions at the same time. And when compared to the ancient Egyptians, we think that we are more developed and advanced. But all evidence shows that the ancient Egyptians also had amazing technology, but it was lost a long time ago, and we did not know its truth until now, except for speculations from here and there. In this video, we will know what technology the ancient Egyptians used in shaping these gigantic edifices and in refining these statues, which it is inconceivable that they were made with primitive tools. Rather, they were made with a technique that modern science is unable to provide a convincing explanation for. Before we start, do not forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel to encourage us to continue and provide useful scientific material. The ancient Egyptians came to the law of cancelling earthly gravity in lifting and cutting stones in building pyramids and cutting obelisks. Scientists in the modern era mentioned that the ancient Egyptians knew the use of infrasound waves and converting them into ultrasound waves through tectonic plates that come from the pyramids by a quarter of a Richter in cutting stones for obelisks that contain 55% silicon quartz, so the stone is cut like and smooth as glass. There are two papyri, the first found in the tomb of an engineer from the Old Kingdom in Karnak. The second papyrus about the ancient Egyptians is in the Louvre Museum in Paris, France. And they knew that the ancient Egyptians were able to control many cosmic forces and exploited their energy to achieve their scientific purposes and used the pendulum to place the stones so that they coincide with the direction of their veins in the mountains to be more resistant to erosion factors. And the magnetism of the earth, and this theory proves the error of previous theories about the ways in which the stones were built in the pyramids. Recent research indicates that the ancient Egyptians used a group that works with sound vibrations and electrostatic charges, which charge the stones with electric charges equivalent to the electric charge of the earth, and disharmony occurs between these stones and the earth. So it starts to rise from the ground, and it is controlled by this wondrous device, which was called, Osiris's magical box, so this box, when used, makes the weights weightless, so it continues to lift the stone to be placed in the required place, then the amount of the charge is reduced, so the stone begins to fall to the specified place for him. And it proves that the ancient Egyptians were able to cancel the Earth's gravity when lifting stones and fixing them to long distances, when directing special sound vibrations and electrostatic charges to facilitate the process of lifting stones. Thus, it is proven that the ancient Egyptians used a lost technology that the modern world does not know anything about and that the cosmic energy is that the pharaohs knew did not reach them in our modern era. He follows. With regards, Ahmed El Flo, 